Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. This week's video is another bullet journal plan with me for the month of December 2020. Since it is December, I decided to stay through this month's theme by incorporating different elements of winter and Christmas in general. So there's trees with snow on them, snowflakes, robins and deers, all of which you will see throughout this month's layout. So this month, instead of using my usual highlighters, I decided to use brown paper instead. Um, I got this off an old envelope, which is a really handy way of reusing things, and also a lot cheaper than buying actual coloured paper. So I've used this to add colour to each of the spreads, and I've incorporated it in different ways throughout this monthly layout. I also go back over the brown paper to add smaller details that stand out more from the rest of the spread. For example here I'm including flowers to the vine whereas all the other trees currently have no leaves. And finally, I'm quickly outlining the text with my usual Stablio fine liner before going back in with the far ticker marker and then adding highlights using a silver CD pen. Now on to the first of my five weekly layouts for this month. I actually went off script quite a lot with this particular layout in comparison to how I had it originally sketched out. I just felt that the boxes weren't large enough for what I wanted to write in them every day, so I increased the size and reduced some of the details I had included in the images. also included my usual what I read this week, what I watched this week, as well as a habit tracker for each of my weekly layouts. Once again, I go back in with a thicker marker to each of my drawings as well as the silvery CD pen to add just a bit of colour and something that stands out lightly in every spread. I also decided to use washi tape for this month's layout, which is 
something that I usually don't do despite quite a large collection I have of washi tape, so I've only used it very minimally just to add a little bit of extra colour. For this week's drawing, I wanted to make the ground a little rougher looking by using pieces of paper as well as adding the occasional tree made of brown paper. So to do this, I cut out the pieces into the correct size and glued them down. And for the trees, I went back with the scissors and cut very carefully along the edge of each strip to give it the equivalent of leaves. As you will see later, I do go back with the scissors to make the edges a bit sharper, but please be careful while doing this because it can be a bit dangerous.
this drawing definitely took the longest time out of everything I did for this month's layout and cutting it was an absolute nightmare so please be careful if you're doing something similar because there are a lot of small parts and it is very easy to cut yourself with the scissors. That's it for this week's video, I hope you liked it, please subscribe and comment down below if there are any videos you'd like to see, because I make new videos every two weeks. Here's a quick overview of how the final journal looked.